Welcome back to Button Smashing and our playthrough of Batman the Telltale series. We're still on episode one. We about to get back over to Wayne Manor, I suppose, because that's where our cut scene started. I yeah, think. we just got done talking to our old friend, Oswald. Oswald. <laughs> Cobblepot. Oswald? Well, I had to make sure because I've been messing up names left yes, and right like ridiculous. A little bit, a little bit. Aww. Oh, how sweet. Yo, that's my ride? If this asshole... Is this my ride? No. That's the whip! Oh, it is. Oh, that's the whip. Oh, okay. My bad. I thought it was... Falcone. Just rolling up in this in this ride. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Mister. Yeah. You gotta play all amenable and everything. Mm -hmm. Mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> you got jokes. You got jokes. I get it. I'm rich. Yeah. You're not. I understand. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. It's uh, secure. Uh, what's that? And worse still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Arkham Asylum <gasps> is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this okay how do i get through this you you you, you walked us into this the art mental health care facility one that will improve the well-being of gotham and its citizens for years to come now, mr wayne has a few words he'd like to say bruce uh my parents would be honored my parents loved gotham they invested their blood sweat and tears in this city. okay that's a pretty nice answer yeah you know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. Mm -hmm. A hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, yep. no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man. Oh no, are they okay? Who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. We need a new face for Gotham. This facility and our next mayor, we create a new face for Gotham. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we wow, y'all chose. Okay, that's bold. And usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Okay, those are some polite ass claps. Yeah. Sure, you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Of Thank course. You. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? Uh, tear it down. We should tear down the walls and erase it from the map. I don't want us lingering on past mistakes. I want us to focus on Gotham's future. I thought that was a pretty good answer. I mean, we're about to find out what it means. Okay, well, damn. You there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources. Oh, I like the way you spell your name, girl. Carmine Falcone into your home. You even shook his hand. He was Harvey's guest. Harvey is the one who invited him. Oh, you threw Harvey under the bus. You threw Harvey under the bus. Oh, shit. I think I just fucked up. Yo, you threw Harvey way under the bus. Retex. But Mr. Wayne, this morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore... Can we rewind? By God, dog. ...and your father, Thomas Wayne. Yo. Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Hmm. Yo. No comment. I don't comment on rumors. Why don't we just stick to real journalism here? Mr. Wayne. He just pulled the fake news. He fooled. He pulled the fake news. You know about this, Bruce? 
Marcos, how long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What are you telling us? Does this interview is over. Enterprises paychecks? All right, this I already fucked up by throwing Harvey under the bus, and I didn't mean to. Mr. Wayne, how long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Did you know this is a bad look. What are you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. They found your bat cave. Oh, shit. And all of your porn. The pages are so sticky. Why, Bruce? Why? Damn, well, they gonna damn, go we didn't have to do job? all of that, people. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. And it's not personal. I didn't do anything. The lights off, keep a low profile. I'm sorry, are you arresting me? Not unless I'm forced to. We're only collecting evidence today. I didn't do anything. That's what we're here to find out. Alfred. Keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what, what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any company. What do you expect to find? And what do you expect to find? That's for our analysts back at the precinct to figure out. I can't comment. Hmm. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. Oh, uh, that was the shots. Mayor Hill's corrupt. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. <laughs> Quick, Bruce, go hide your blow-up dolls. And the porn with the sticky pages. Aw, oh, did they knock off? Please tell me. Please don't do this to me. Yep, they gonna do it to me. Yep, they did it. Mm -hmm. Yo, can I put on the suit and just like knock that dude around a little bit? Cause that was a little, that was, that was beyond careless. Yeah. Do I have to see this again? Yeah, you know. I don't know how many how many Batman movies have there been where they've just been like, hey, we get to watch Thomas and Martha Wayne get killed. Yeah. Why did you say that name? <coughs> My goodness, that was a cough. No. Oh. What the hell do you want? Hey, she's the one, she's not the one who brought this up. I'm okay with her. To interrupt, but you keep showing up uninvited. This is the second time you've shown up uninvited. Well, it's difficult to book a meeting with you. Well, I well bitch, maybe I don't want to talk to you. Yo, language. Past tense. She's pissed me off. Sorry. But you don't need to be all angry. You're not gonna have any for a while. Emote, Bruce. A scandal surrounding Show the some emotion. Captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Oh? Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of What's your angle? What's your angle? Not all reporters just want a headline. Some of us are old fashioned. I still want the truth. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet, and it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. 
after me. Yeah, you don't mess with the family. Yeah. The sender didn't identify themselves. We have no idea who it could be. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. This is po politically motivated. Hill wants me out of the picture because with my backing, Harvey wins in a landslide. All signs point to Hill. I mean, that's that's a little... You think a little high of yourself there, Brucey boy, but yeah. I mean, I get it. I get it. Yeah, he is, just a little bit. His ego is ahead of him. It's up there. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need oh. to get out of this. Your side... Give quote. ...not wild speculation. On the record, then. Whenever you're ready. My family is innocent. The Wayne family has always been a cornerstone of Gotham. We have never had and never will have connections to what that's exactly don't do that i mean oh God. we might find some stuff out so what would you have picked i don't know exactly Things always come out on top goodbye miss Rowe. Okay, those doors are heavy. Admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. Batman has made plenty of enemies, but my family. We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents. It's not a coincidence. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Yeah. I'll find out why he didn't. So maybe I don't feel bad I threw Harvey underneath the bus, because he still would have did this. Yay or nay? I mean, by that time, it was already in motion, so, you know. Basically. So... Okay, you you really is switching. A warrant? What the hell's going on? I don't know. You freaking tell me. Orders we're talking about this morning? Someone's after me. It's turned into a bloodbath. Yeah, someone's coming after me. Let's avoid making another scene, shall we? Press is already up my ass as it is. Mayor Hill authorized this? Yeah. Then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files. Oh, son of a bitch. You're the goddamn DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this. I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. Enough excuses. He has no right to issue search warrants without my okay. Well, that's just not good enough, Harvey. Listen, I'll look into this. I swear. Oh, so you got me leaning on Harvey Dent? Look at you being a bad girl. Mm -hmm. Why would Hill stick his neck? Because he's full of shit. Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? Gasp. He is. We'll find out. Gasp. I mean, what could he possibly hope I to intend to find out. Other than a few cheap headlines. That is exactly what I intend to find out. Easy, Bruce. You almost use your Batman voice, bruh. Bruce, I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if I can. You're the freaking DEA! Investigation? Not, not DEA. I'm sorry, DA. <laughs> Jesus. For either of us. It would jeopardize I'll do this myself. Campaign. Then I'll go it alone. I've got plenty of resources to fight this. We're in a bind here, Bruce. I'll do whatever I can to help. There you are. Hey, you. Oh, Yo, shit. she got a black eye. We know who that is. Yup. You didn't tell me you were bringing a friend to dinner. This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Uh, I'm Bruce Wayne. Sense. I'm Bruce Wayne. So you are. Pleasure to meet you, Miss... Kyle. It's a strong uh -oh. grip you've got there. Don't worry. I'm not gonna fall. Oh, right. Sorry. Mmm! Mm. I've been showing her around Gotham, introducing her to people. Mm-hmm! What brings you to town? If I lose the election, I guess I can drive one of those double-decker tour buses around town. 
So, Miss Kyle, what brings you to Gotham? Business. Well, let's just hope she stays after what happened last night. What did that happen mind. last night? <gasps> I'm just oh. angry I let that masked freak get away with all my stuff. <laughs> uh, home alone. I should Didn't the police help? Well, that's terrible. Did they catch the guy? Not yet. But if they don't, I will. Okay. It's probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These were important materials. Oh, sensitive? Mm. Very. I don't know how I'm going to explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. What is it you do? Just be thankful you got away with a black eye. <coughs> so, what do you do for a living? It's complicated. High risk, high reward. Ah, stock market. That's a really vague answer. I mean, yeah. That. At least I'm not the only one who's taken a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Do you? I'll handle it. Hmm. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. You asshole! <laughs> uh, it's okay. Me. We'll figure this out. Mm -hmm. This will be okay. Mm -hmm. We got this. Are we just gonna start calling each other by our names, like? Yeah, Catwoman, let's cut the Batman. shit. Batman. No, let's cut the shit. That'd be my thing. Let's cut the shit. You took what I need. So we just not gonna talk then. Okay. Love the stare down. Nice to meet the real you. Uh, likewise. Likewise. This explains a lot, actually. How you can afford the fancy armor, the toys. Wouldn't Harvey be Okay, yeah, I guess we're just gonna cut to the shit. Not to I mention everyone in this cafe. You're with Harvey. What do you want with Harvey? Don't worry about your friend. My interest in him is personal. Hmm. Don't worry. I'm not gonna expose you. Yet. No, bitches, and I can expose you. I'm curious about something, though. I do what I do for money, but you're... Bruce Wayne. What's your excuse? I have to. I like the way the I leather feels reasons. against my giblets. I'll take the risk. I think you know enough already. The rest is my secret. And here I was thinking we were starting to get somewhere. How disappointing. Hmm. You have something that belongs to me. I'm sure I, I do. want it back. This is awkward for me. I'm used Sounds to important. People, not the one being robbed. It must be important. What's on the drive? I don't know. You don't know what you've stolen. It's not my business to know. My clients don't know who I am, and I don't know who they are, or what they're moving. But you know. Smart way to go about it. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. I'm working for. They don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's gonna cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed, and I'm not gonna lie in it alone. Ooh. Oh, is that a threat? If they don't I'll get, get the K they want, you don't need me. Oh, you don't need my help. You seem pretty capable of handling this yourself. Oh, I intend to. Just give me back the drive and I'll be on my merry little way. Yeah, I'd rather not. Listen. I am liking those boots, though. Yeah, I am too. Those boots are kind of fly. Expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address now. No, give me the drive. <sighs> you need to trust me. You're just going to have to trust me. I don't do trust. I guess I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat, not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Maybe a rat in a hat going rat a tat tat? Hmm. Better hurry. See, see that that right there is that, that pure comedy. No, it's not. Yeah. Shut it like, down. That's pure comedy. You tell me. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. I feel better already. Sorry, but I've got to run. So soon? Aren't you gonna stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? Oh, go <laughs> screw that. yourself. I've got another appointment, and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. 
Okay, Selena, that was a little bit too coy. I didn't yeah. like that. And you know what? You know what? That That's not cool. That's not cool. But we're going to Warehouse 133. 133. And you know when we're going to be doing that? Next time on Button Smashing. Next time on Button Smashing. Catch y'all later. Deuces.